We have a, an old blues man friend by the name of Willie Green. Willie, Willie was part of the, the Eagles way back with Muddy Waters and Lightning Hawkins and all these people. He played harmonica backing up Muddy Waters for a little while. And uh, he's originally from Birmingham, Alabama. But he moved to Ocala, Florida uh, back about 60 years ago. He's about 80 years old now and he played on the street corners like many old blues guys do, uh, with the guitar case open, hoping to make enough money to uh, buy some cornbread and biscuits and that kind of thing, and greens to get back to, through the next day. But anyways, why don't you tell them the rest of about Willie <laughs> at Cross Creek? Oh, okay. So he says we're going to dinner, and I always should know. Dinner for him is we're up to something. Many, many places I show up, we have to play for our dinner. <laughs> And I'm not too thrilled about that, you know, so I said to him, are we playing? He says, no, 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 somebody else is going to play. So we went to the Cross Creek and uh, where Marjorie Rollins, Marjorie Kennan Kenan Rollins, Rollins yeah. told the story. Wrote the Yearling and... Uh, so he's sitting there playing and he's watching them because this is, he's the real deal. That's his nickname. He is the real deal. And he's playing this beat up kind of guitar and he's doing the harmonica to just blow everybody out of the box. And I'm watching him. And finally, we get, we get through dinner and everything, and he comes over because he was so attentive. And I said to him, do you have your music? Because it's just what musicians do. They ask each other, they either trade or do something. And he turned around and he said, yeah, I got, I got, I got music. And he says, it's a baby kind of record. I said, CD. So he ran back to his trailer because he lives on the property because he was playing weekly in this restaurant. And when he came back, he had a CD. It didn't have a picture on it, didn't have a case. And I said, what's that? And he said, your friend from WMNF, Pete Gallagher, he, he made that of me. That's me in there. And I said, okay. I said, now I need you to sign it. Well, I thought he was going to kill me because I had no idea what I had asked this man to do. And I handed him a pen and he was smarter than me. Well, he just said, you sign it, I'll spell it. I did. I wrote Willie B. Green. Willie has a signature now. Shame on you. Anyway. So anyways, this is a song we wrote for him. He asked us to bring us to, him to St. Petersburg to do some recording. We didn't oh, have a way Lord. to get him there. So, uh, so we figured we'd just make up a song for him instead. <laughs> That's what songwriters do. Yes. It goes like this. Walk all the way to St. Pete. I said, my friend Willie Green, he's gonna walk all the way to St. Pete. And by the time that he gets there, he's gonna have blisters on his feet. Now Willie plays a mean harp and an old Gibson guitar. He plays a mean
give that man a chair, Willie Green. Thank you. Willie Green, please.